And this is Dr. Boone, the rural eye surgeon and ophthalmologist up here in North Western Pennsylvania and Southwestern New York for 45 years. I'm retired now, but I've been had been uh, working in a small community and as a volunteer and to the, do some cataract surgery in uh, along with uh, SAE, which is Surgical Eye Expenditure. This is an uh, organization which send the uh, eye surgeon to make a free implant to join the eye surgeon around the world. I have been uh, opportunity to talk to you about the, the eye surgery in the uh, rural area. If you are interested, you can send a comment what you like to see and to show. If you some people, the side myself, I like to watch Dr. Paul, the animal eye, uh, animal doctor, who's uh, take care of the, the animal. But uh, for myself, I take care of the human. So this is eye. I take the picture right now. So the that's a normal eye. I took the picture from uh, real people from many years ago. And uh, I tell you about the, most likely the, Cataract is interesting to help people, to poor people, to take care and uh, to make them s s uh, improve the sight so they can uh, and have a opportunity to uh, see the eye now. I'm going to show you the, about what we do the, we have remove the cataract and then we put the implants on the old day in 1970. And there was training in Great about more medical centers, no implants, so you have to wear thick, thick glasses. So right now, the one I show you here is uh, the modern for the plastic uh, implant, which is uh, uh, make a replicate, make it larger. The actual one is right in a little tiny tip on the stick right there is a small, tiny one. The top one here is uh, original implant of uh, Dr. Choice and Dr. Binghaus and Dr. Fyodorov from Brazil. But the, the real actual right now is about where I show you right in the tip of this uh, right here. This is about six millimeter of the implant right in the tip of the small one. When you put the implant now, the old day, there's no, when you remove the cataract, so you have to wear the thick, thick glass I show you when I have in my chair. So right here, the when after you put implants on, you can see the the old day, the middle scarex surgery. So you have to make a little tiny hole on the eyeball to make sure they don't get the glaucoma. You can see a little tiny hole, the lens in the middle, right there. And this another one here, this another side. Another one right in the middle, and uh, so so the I will show you the bow. So in 1970, I have opportunity where I was in training up in Greater Baltimore Medical Center, uh, as which is our professor teaching us is from mostly John Hopkins Hospital. And uh, so they have got our chief resident went there for a month up with doc with the missionary eye doctor in Taxila, Pakistan, which is what uh, see a little building here. We I went there in uh, April 1970. So the doctor. The said now Christy, he's a major eye surgeon in Taxila. He's about not too far from Rawalpindi, the capital of the Pakistan. See him, his wife. To uh, I stay with him for a month. We operate in the spring and the fall because the weather is not too hot or not too cold. Yeah right there in front of his house and 
Then uh, during uh, Easter time, they have uh, a family and friends, and uh, they have uh, the celebration for the, Christ, uh, the Christian uh, for Easter, right in front of the house. And I in the dining area with me is uh, with the, the Dr. Christie and the family. So at uh, at that time, in the small uh, hospital had uh, capacity on the 30, 40 people, but uh, we up the Dr. Christie operate about 200 to 250 cataract in a day at that time no implant the people have to wear thick glasses they have to do surgery start at uh, midnight and uh, it taking about two minutes for cataract surgery for, uh, in each case so I like dr christie here he didn't have time to sit down so he's standing and operate with the helping and uh, take him two minutes to carry it for cataract surgery with one stitches and then another Lady eye surgeon from uh, missionary eye surgeon. So when you do cataract surgery like this, so they have to wear the. the I show you what wear. When we do surgery, this is what you know, for the loop. For the loop, when we do eye surgery, that's all we need for do surgery. And uh, after eye surgery. You have to wear thick, thick glasses. See that? See how? See how glasses about 25 percent the uh, magnification. You know you have to learn how to dry and walk again with this one. So, and then uh, at the after in the weekend when I don't have any snow surgery on the weekend, so I have opportunity to visit. Uh, Buddhist University at the taxi line there, which is about almost uh, 2,600 years old. Now that's the Buddha, when he was enlightenment to be the Buddha, so 